My name is Dr. Robert W. Allen. I am the head of the School of Forensic Sciences, Oklahoma State University Center for Health Sciences here in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Our forensic science program leads to a master's degree in one of four disciplines within the overall field of forensic science. Those disciplines include forensic DNA, forensic chemistry, forensic psychology, and our newest track known as death scene investigation, which is essentially people who are trained to go to the scene of unexplained death and be the eyes and ears of the medical examiner on site. Our research in, um, in each of these four tracks is very cutting edge, uh, as is typical of Oklahoma State University in general. In the forensic biology area, we've developed a new collection device for uh, capturing DNA on items that have been touched, including uh, IEDs or uh, handguns or anything that has been held in the hand of a perpetrator of a crime. Uh, following up on the IED application, uh, our chemistry section has a lot of cutting-edge research in um, explosives. It is recognized officially by the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, and Firearms as a site in which field agents can receive training necessary for their certification every year. So I guess when you think about our program as a whole, one of the real advantages of our program over others. Uh, we first, we are accredited by the American Academy of Forensic Science for excellence in graduate education in the forensic sciences, but also we have a tremendous number of actual practitioners of the various disciplines that teach in our coursework, live in our building in the crime lab for the City of Tulsa Police Department which is one floor below the forensic science program, and also the Oklahoma State Medical Examiner's Eastern Regional Office, which is also on our campus. The presence of these practitioners makes contact between students and practitioners of forensic science almost unavoidable, which is a good thing. They come to our seminars. In some cases, they have lunch with students. So there's a, a continual interchange under a relaxed set of conditions so that a student really gets to immerse themselves in the practice of their chosen profession during their master's training with us.